Okay guys, welcome back once again to DJ Pablo TV. I'm your host Paul, aka DJ Pablo, and it's a Friday evening, guys, and I got another pretty interesting album for you guys. So I'm saying tonight we're gonna to be going over Marl and Quill's album, Blessed Little Bastards 3. So I'm saying, guys, and it's a pretty exciting album, guys. So I'm saying one of the few trap albums I've heard since last year. So I'm saying even though I'm doing it in 2019 here, it came out on December the 14th, guys, and it's one of the better albums that came out in December, so I'm saying there's a lot of hot tracks on it, man. And I'm gonna be going over all of them for you right now. So I'm saying breaking down, give you my opinion as usual, tell you which ones are my favorites, and there are a lot of them on this album, so I'm saying. And let's give you my feedback as far as the album is concerned, so I'm saying. So without further ado, let me just jump right in real quick and get it over, so I'm saying, guys. So the album, it's got 17 tracks on it, guys, and it starts off pretty nice right here with track one called being in these streets and i'm saying pretty hot track i love the beat on that one and they start off real nice on that so i'm saying giving you that real new school trap atlanta type flavor right there i enjoyed that one then they step things up a notch that i'm saying guys on track two which is called mexico this one right here real hot beat crazy so i'm saying i really enjoyed this one this is one track that will get you driving faster in your car. If you're driving and this one comes on, your foot is going to get heavy on the gas, man. I hope you can control yourself, see what I'm saying? That kind of music you want to drive to when you're going on a long road trip. Mexico right here is definitely one of them, see what I'm saying? Real hot. I love it. One of my favorites on the album. Then we get to track three, which is called Dolce & Gabbana. Another hot track right here featuring Hood Rich Juan Pablo. So I'm saying salute to Hood Rich Juan Pablo. So I'm saying did well on this one. I love this one as well. Crazy bars on this. And the beat was solid. I really enjoyed that one, so I'm saying. Another track you will want to be driving a little bit faster when you hear that coming on in the car, so I'm saying. But at the end of the day, you gotta be careful, so I'm saying, guys. This is definitely a track you're gonna be putting on repeat, so I'm saying. I love that one, called Dolce Gabbana, so I'm saying. And then we get to track four, which is called Birds of a Feather, so I'm saying. That one, another hot track on the album, so I'm saying. They went in on that one as well, did their thing. Then we get to track five, so I'm saying called What's Happening. Now this one right here, another favorite guys. This one's crazy, so I'm saying the beats, hot salute to the producer of this one. You did real well, so I'm saying, and I love this. This one I played like four times, I had to play it over and over again, because I was too busy admiring the beat as well as the flow, so I'm saying. They went in real nice on this guys, real crazy. This is a real true trap song, so I'm saying, songs that make you feel like you're in the South, so I'm saying guys. And this is definitely one of my favorites on the album. Something you will have to put on repeat. Guaranteed, so I'm saying. Then we get to track six, which is called Fortnite. Not a cool track on the album. They did their thing on this as well, so I'm saying. Then we get to track seven, which is called Oakland. Now Oakland, hot, so I'm saying. I enjoyed this one right here. Then we have track eight, which is called Bag of Cash. Bag of Cash, real hot, beats crazy. This right here, also one of my favorites on the album, guys. I truly enjoyed this one again, see what I'm saying? And it's like every track from here on to the end of the album just went off real crazy. I think by the time you get to Bag of Cash, guys, is when things just really step up even way, way crazier on the album, see what I'm saying? They turn on the heat right here and they went in hard on everything until the album ends, see what I'm saying? So that one, one of my favorites, Bag of Cash, track eight. Then we get to track nine, which is called Meet Millie. This one right here hot so i'm saying i enjoyed this one as well they went hard on that then we get to track 10 guys which is called live it up featuring little got it and guac tarantino crazy crazy bars on this guys the beats hot they went in on this real hard so i'm saying and they bodied this one this one definitely gonna be on repeat one of the favorites on the album guys so i'm saying and shout us little got it man i know he's got a new album coming up i did do a video of this past album so i'm saying hood baby i want you guys to go check that out so i'm saying that one's real nice from little guy and i know he's got a new album coming up soon so i'm saying so you guys can go check that out on my channel as well so i'm saying guys truly enjoyed that one so i'm saying guys salute to guap tarantino man they went in real nice on this and i truly enjoyed it i just want to repeat a couple of times as well then we get to track 11 which is called beat monster featuring q money salute to q money this was crazy so i'm saying Salute to the producer on this man. They were killing it on the beat, so I'm saying, and the bars were just coming in, and I truly enjoyed this one as well. So I'm saying, guys, the kind of music I like to drive to, man. So I'm saying, 
this is the kind of music you go on a long road trip, you hit high 95, and you got something real nice to keep your company on your journey, so what I'm saying? This track right here is one of the hot tracks that I would love to play doing that kind of driving. It's called Beat Monster featuring Q Money. Truly enjoyed that one, real hot, one of my favorites on the album. Then we get to track 12, which is called Blue Lagoon. Another hot track, crazy beat on this as well. They went in real hard on this, guys. And this is definitely one more of my favorites. And as I said, I had a lot of favorites on this album, so what I'm saying? One of the better track albums that came out in 2018, so what I'm saying? And this one right here, the Blue Lagoon, also one of my favorites. Then we get to track 13, which is called Gucci Shoes. Crazy. Gucci Shoes, the beat, hot, the bars, crazy. They destroyed this, what I'm saying? They went in real nice on this, guys. Definitely had that one on repeat as well. And then we get to track 14, which I think is the hardest track on the entire album, so what I'm saying, guys? To me, at least, this one right here was the most craziest track, apart from the Live It Up with Little Guy, so what I'm saying, and Guap Tarantino. This one right here, guys, track 14, Never Know feature with Little Cole, crazy. That is like my all-time favorites on this album, so what I'm saying, the one with the most heat, so what I'm saying, I truly enjoyed this. Salute to Little Cole, so what I'm saying, guys, salute to the producer on this. They went in real nice on this, and you will definitely notice this one standing out over all of the other tracks on the album. Definitely the headliner of the entire album, guys, so what I'm saying, and I truly enjoy that. That one's gonna have to be on repeat a couple of times. Then we get to track 15, which is called Miami. Another hot track, so what I'm saying, guys. I enjoy this as well, the beat crazy on this salute to the producer of that one as well i gotta make sure the producers get their props so i'm saying salute to you i don't have your name but i enjoyed the production on this and the bars were real crazy so i'm saying salute to martin quill so i'm saying guys and then i get to track 16 which is called kodak another crazy track on the album again guys one more hot beat they went in spitting some crazy bars on this again truly represented representing for the new school of hip-hop, so I'm saying, and showing that true trap star, so I'm saying, guys. And I definitely love this one as well, I enjoyed it, and this is something, if you are truly a hip-hop head and you are from the new school, and you like this trap stuff, you will definitely enjoy this album. This track right here, one of my favorites on the album as well. So I'm saying, it's called Kodak, then we get to track 17, which is the final track on the album. This one's called Wait Up, real hot. So I'm saying, guys, and I love the beat on this. I love the production on it. So I'm saying, I love the piano they play in the background on it. So I'm saying, salute to the producer. You did well on this. Kind of different, but I truly enjoyed this beat right here. So I'm saying, guys, real hard. And I think it's a pretty way to wrap up the album, man. It's real exciting. 17 tracks, something you can drive to. There are a lot of favorites on this album, guys. I had a lot of songs on this song repeat. So I'm saying, so it's something you will definitely enjoy. Never know featuring Little Cole, crazy. I think it's hottest on the album. Live It Up featuring Little Got It and Guap Tarantino. Crazy. Another crazy banger on the album. Beat Monster with Q Money. Crazy. So I'm saying those are like the real headliners on the album right there. So I'm saying and Dolce and Gabbana featuring Hoodrich One Pablo guys. Crazy again on the album. So I'm saying one of the hot ones right there again. So I'm saying Bag of Cash. One of my favorites on it as well. So I'm saying right there. And What's Happening. Also another hot track. And there's quite a few more on it. So what I'm saying, guys, as I said, there's a lot of favorites here, man. It's something you would definitely enjoy if you're a trap head or you love this new school hip-hop stuff. So I'm saying you're a young kid, you're just getting into hip-hop, and this is your generation, this is your kind of music. You'll definitely enjoy this. And I want you to hop over to iTunes real quick, give it a listen, and definitely cop this if you're a true hip-hop head. So I'm saying? So if you love that new stuff, and you have your big speakers in the trunk, you want to blast something for tomorrow, so I'm saying, guys, you hop over to iTunes, give it a listen, cop that. Put it on your phone and that way tomorrow when you're out on the road, you got something nice to drive to. See what I'm saying, guys? So with that said, man, I'm just going to wrap it up before I go. I want to say salute to Marl and Quill. See what I'm saying? Marl, G, and Little Quill. I truly enjoyed that album, guys. See what I'm saying? And salute to you guys. You really did well on the album right here. A very nice collab, guys. And I, I truly enjoyed it, man. I can't wait to see what you guys do next. But you definitely produce a lot of heat on this album. See what I'm saying, guys? And... This is definitely a banging album as far as trap is concerned. One of the better albums that came out in December for the trap scene. So I'm saying, guys. So with that said, man, I'm gonna wrap it up the usual way. But before I go, I wanna say for the people who are watching me for the first time, make sure you hit the subscribe button and turn the notification bell on. That way you know when my videos are up. So I'm saying, and for the people who are watching that never subscribed, it's 2019, man. One of these days you're gonna be doing it. So I'm saying. Until then, keep watching, enjoy, and whenever you're ready. You can always go back to hitting the subscribe button. So I'm saying to my regular subscribers, thank you guys for always being here with me. And I'm gonna wrap it up the usual way, man. Peace and salute from West Palm Beach, and I'm out of here. And I'll see you guys on my next video. All right. So I'll put iTunes right now. Go check it out. So I'm saying, guys, 
Blessed Little Bastard 3 by Maul and Quill. Go check it out, guys. Support the album. And I'll see you guys on my next video, all right? Peace.